Hey guys, good afternoon. Welcome back to another beautiful day in Grand Cayman. So guys, today, as per usual my routine, go for a nice walk on the beach. I want to talk about in this video um, what not to do, some tips and tricks of coming here to the Cayman Islands so you're more prepared when you come here for your vacation. It's a lovely day. Nice little breeze. Hopefully the wind, um, hopefully uh, you're able to hear me through this wind. But yeah, it's a beautiful day right by the Cape Sea Fire. Let's go. So, right by the Cape Sea Fire. Beautiful hotel. Generally go that way. I'm gonna go this way instead. Nice restaurant. Coco Lobo. And yeah, you got the Kimpton Sea Fire right here. Sea Fire. It's a nice hotel, guys. Five stars on Forbes. If that means anything to you. Some clouds in the distance, but hopefully these clouds stay away. We're on this boardwalk, <coughs> which runs parallel to the beach, the Playa, Playa de Cayman. But yeah, leaving the sea fire now, making our way to Public Beach. Ah, I was hoping to potentially find a coconut. You see these, uh, these, they have these coconut trees here and they're quite low. But unfortunately, it looks like these trees have been trimmed, so no coconuts. That's a pity. So yeah guys, I wanted to talk about um, you know, what not to do, I guess, things to keep in mind when you're traveling here. I guess the first one, most importantly, we are British Overseas Territory, and we drive on the left-hand side of the road. So if you're like me, you come from North America, where we drive on the right, we drive on the left. So that's very important to remember at all times, stay on the left. Because um, <clears throat> I think people come here and they rent a car and they maybe forget, and they drive on the other side so be very careful about that sad to see calico jacks you know empty it is still nothing's been done i'm surprised they haven't you know reopened this for when the cruise ships came i can see there's no cruise ships in port so this area is very quiet today but yeah they have chairs for guests who are coming on the ships but yeah calico jacks is now still abandoned Super sad to see. And yeah, now we're entering the public beach area, which is a great place to come to and relax. Another tip, we're coming here. This island the currency we use here is called the Cayman Island Dollars. You can use US dollars everywhere, but just keep in mind if you pay in US dollars, you will get changed to CI dollars. If you're lucky, some people might have US change, but in most cases, they will give you CI. So just keep that in mind. Every, a lot of places accept credit card, credit cards, but um, places that don't accept credit cards, they have to pay them in cash. You give them the US, they'll give you CI back. So keep that in mind. It's completely empty. Yeah, they have vendors rent the chairs to the cruise ship guests. Come over there. So yeah, public beach guys. Great area to come to. They have these cabanas. <clears throat> they have this like playground for the kids. And yeah, people sell the chairs to. Um, 
locals and tourists alike. So yeah, another um, tip, you know, if you are renting a condo or a vacation rental, you know, if you buy groceries and cook it yourself, you'll definitely save quite a bit of money instead of going out every day. Of course, if you want to go every day, by all means, there's some great restaurants here, but some restaurants are expensive, some are a little less expensive. I like a restaurant called Peppers, you find authentic Caribbean jerk chicken, other things that are very tasty. It's nice here. We got this big field for football, so you can play some soccer, or, or we say in Canada, or football. Oh. My hat. This wind, it always blows it off quite easily. Look at this, guys. This is razor sharp, I bet. Yeah, wow. I'm not sure if it's silver thatch palm or looks like it. Ah, this hat's like blowing off my head. Just under the shade here. Another advice, you know, buy local stuff, buy local drinks, like beer for instance, which is my favorite, like white tip. Buy local commodities here, try local things, you know, things they won't get in your home, home country. Always nice to try local, buy local, you know. Also, it's kind of pissed off locals and like, people who live here from here. People call the Cayman Islands the Caymans. I think that's very American. And Canadian too. Like I'm going to the Caymans. <laughs> it's the Cayman Islands, but I guess people can say that, but just keep in mind if you're saying Caymans, you might piss off some people. So there are some coconuts up there, but that's too high. Very too, much too high for me. I really want a coconut. But yeah, these trees are too high. Bomb McLeod. Mr. Rooster. Another advice. Take a rent a car. Go around the island. See what other parts of the island have to offer. If you want to stay on the beach, hey, that's great too, but it's always nice to do some activities, go to see my city. Crystal Caves just opened recently, so that's a fun uh, adventure north side but yeah rent a car go on the island experience some things you haven't seen before it's always nice also be aware a lot of places close quite early this island you know it's uh places don't stay open very late especially the restaurants and bars um, shopping is closed pretty much at 5 o'clock. A lot of shopping places are closed, so just keep that in effect. You know, current places like North America where places open very late here in Cayman, places close very early compared to other places in the world. You know, it's a very religious island. You know, unfortunately, gay marriage is not, um, especially by the old generation, is not considered right. Um, I don't really want to get into that topic, but. Uh, no, it's, this island is a little bit different from other places, different laws, different beliefs. So, my grandfather would say, to each their own. So, so folks, that will conclude this little video on um, tips and tricks on coming to the Cayman. If you have any questions or want to add anything, make sure to put it in the comment section below. If you haven't um, subscribed, make sure you subscribe and I'll see you next time. Alright guys, let's put this hat back on, hopefully it won't pull off. Mr. Cayman, sign off. Cheers guys. Bye.